So you might notice that our background image appears to be a little too bright. And so what we're going to do is we're actually going to apply a CSS filter for that background image. Now, if you research some things about the CSS filters, you can find this page over here on W3 Schools, which allows you to see the different types of CSS filters that you can apply. So what we're going to do is we're going to apply a contrast filter of 75% to reduce the contrast of that pizza image here. So you can see it's very bright right now. The, the yellows are very bright and it's, it's very distracting. So what we want to do is we're just going to go here and we're going to type filter and we're going to say contrast and we are going to say 75%. Now, so that dims the image that reduces the contrast, which is what we want, but we could see that we've actually now created a stacking context, which means that we've now put this image into the stack of the, of the page and now it's above the banner. And so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go to the banner and we're gonna say Z index 999. And so what that's going to do is put the Z index stacking order above that background image for the banner. So I know that was a lot, but let's go ahead and add those properties in here. So we're going to say again in the banner, we're going to say filter contrast 75%, save that, and then go back to the nav bar and make sure we have the Z index at a greater number than the banner or any other element. There we go. So now we see we have reduced contrast here on the banner and it's a little less distracting. So that's great. So now we're just gonna commit that. 